That. So for that, you need to go to Google and then type in uh, Taxira TFS. After, go to Downloads. It's directly to the download section of Taxira.com. And uh, click on Node.js. I just want to download the X application now. And it uh, downloads will begin. So so it's gonna take a bit of time and I've already downloaded that so I won't download so let me check it out what's the name so it's there already so I'll install it I'll quit the browser so so what you need to do is that when it's with when it uh, get download gets downloaded, just double click on that and it will mount it, mount the disk, and then click on install. It's actually empty. So it will ask you for permission, and then just click on open. Just click continue. Once again, click continue. Um, just click agree that's the license agreement if you want then you can like on read license which I think maybe on a external website so I don't and then click on install and then enter your password if you have one it installs so click on file versions and uh, of which I have six days left sadly so just click on continue once again your password so it says restart so actually you don't need to restart now for now there's one more thing you need to do so that so just go to the terminal and you're like uh, uh, type in what I type for now. Type sudo sudo after that nano n a n o then a space and then you call it black backslash or slash I don't know. Then then clear uh, then type in etc and then fs tab. Right. Then you enter in your password. So let me let me restart. So so first off you need to write in type in to it label. So we need to you know write here the label means name of the drive which we want to you know, enable NTFS support on. So for me it's bootcamp. So I want to enable uh, write support on bootcamp which is a uh, NTFS disk and uh, which is no, actually, till now the uh, write support for anti files is enabled. But in case you're talking to your anti um, uh, disk, you know, actor, it plan the plan expires. To, um, you know, when it expires, so you need to need an alternate method. So for that, you need to go to you know. Uh, so this is uh, you know we can't write because it. So see the permissions. Or we can't write because it's an NTFS file or disk. So, so to enable alternatively, we need to you know write its label. So in case whatever be the label, we need to write here. And it's better be it better be a single word meant no spaces in between the name like uh, GTA Phi, nothing like that. Your disk label should be simple like boot camp. It's a single word. So that makes it simple or things make it more complicated if it's not and you can't even rename here so you 
make the windows environment to rename or then I think underscores may work right with underscores like if it's a space then uh, GTA underscore five if it's a space or if it's or just uh, GTA five that don't work maybe just we need to restart anyways so my is boot amp so here we need to type in none and then ntfs so ntfs and then we need to type in uh, ntfs and then rw comma auto and then comma no browse browse rws so you're done here so press control and then o on your you know press control plus o next no plus control o on your keyboard and then press enter so it will save to the file and it shows your word two lines so that's all now what you need to you know do is uh, restart your system again just wait a second so open all in yeah so it shows the volumes um still not so i need to restart your system